PCNL in obese patient is difficult. Here is a patient of uh, 150 kg, male patient with large stone in the pelvis. RIRS is done, passing access sheath in a post entered case, and pulverization is done with high energy and high frequency. As the HU units were low, stone could be pulverized very fast and fine fragmentation is done after some time with fragment with uh, popcorn technique. High frequency, high energy made the pulverization faster. Approximately 2.5 cm stone to 3 cm stone this is and at the end reasonably small fragments were weighed which can be passed through the ureter this is a second stone which was broken in the initial period again kept in the upper calyx and pulverized to fine fragments. Respiratory movements are controlled during this time as they were disturbing in the upper calyx. When the stone is large piece, popcorn is not possible. When stone is small pieces like this, popcorn method is possible during this time if it is confined to one calyx and high energy and high frequency is used rapid fragmentation is possible and more the time spent in the calyx with these settings more the pulverization All the calyces are systematically infected at the end. To ensure that bigger fragment is not left behind. Careful spending of time in the calyx. will make the fragments finer and finer and sometimes lot of dust also is generated so called pop dusting and at the end stenting is done this patient presented after 10 days with uh, loin pain we did a CT scan surprisingly complete clearance of the fragments were there then we removed the stent after gentle relook 